good morning. I'm Maggie Johnston, and we're going to do some exploring today, looking at tiny things that you can find pretty much anywhere, even in your own backyard, or even on a stick that you pick up and bring into your a house or apartment. And we're going to use a special kind of magnifier. It's called a jeweler's loop, but you don't have to have one of these. You can have a magnifying glass, you can have just your eye, but it's all about observation and paying attention to the tiny things. Have fun. So the way that you start your tiny journey is by looking at things closer and closer and closer. So we're going to think about it from the point of, we're looking at trees off in the distance. But you can take a closer look at the leaf on the tree and notice some things about that leaf. That leaf, I'm going to notice that it's brown. It's got several shades of brown. It's got lots of holes in it. It's been in half. You could keep going, noticing things about your leaf. Next, I'm going to wonder about it because I really do wonder what made it curl into that shape? What made the holes in it? Hmm. Is it on the ground because it fell off the tree naturally or did something knock it off the tree? I wonder if it came from last fall when the leaves fell off the trees. And then let's take an even grander look by pulling it in close and looking at it. Oh, wow. It's, the holes actually have spider webs inside of them. So much cool stuff to be seen. As you're starting to get into this thinking about what do you notice about the object, what do you wonder about the object, take it a step further. What else does it remind you of? That's kind of a cool thing to think about. I picked up this leaf and I'll show you up close in a minute. The leaf is beautiful. It's got lots and lots of holes in it. I don't know if you can see it from there, but it's almost like it's transparent and it's got another little leaf stuck to it. These are all things I'm noticing about it. Now, when I look at it really up close, oh, it also reminds me of, of, oh, lace. It reminds me of the, um, if I turn it this direction, it reminds me of trees that have lost all their leaves in the winter. It reminds me of a, a road map of a city. So many things. As I show you photographs, I want you to think about what they remind you of, especially when I zoom in and get close. You can do the same thing at home. When you are looking at something up close, start thinking about, hmm, what else does it remind me of? Pause and grab some paper and a writing utensil. Let's take a look at this pine tree. We're going to zoom in so that you're looking at not only the tree, but also some of the new growth. And we'll look at it up close. Pause and jot down on your paper what you notice what you wonder about, and what it reminds you of. Take a look at this object and tell me what you notice, what do you wonder, and take it one step further. What else does it remind you of? Remember to pause so you can write things down.
Thank you.